Hey friends, Allison again, dropping in to share with you a new scrapbooking layout. This one is nautical themed and was created with my Cricut. Once again, I cut this background, uh, the scallop, um, like fish scale design. I was trying to think of the right word. Uh, overlay is actually the right word. With my Cricut, I cut it from navy blue cardstock and I decided to mat it over some white cardstock just so that you wouldn't see the red stitching poking out from underneath the cut file. I wanted to hide the red stitching, the ends of it at least anyways, uh, so it looks like it's an illusion. It would go all around the page and not just on the bottom third, roughly. I also cut the steering wheel, <laughs> for lack of a better word. Uh, I don't know what they are actually called on ships, but the steering wheel, the wheel that you run the ship with. I cut that with my Cricut from neutral paper. There's a green scallop border that I cut as well. And as you can see, I am working on adding my photo to the layout. I'm just popping it up with some craft foam. I got mine from the Dollarama, but there is a number of places that you could get yours from. So the story behind this layout is the fact that chocolate chips in my house do not last. I buy them for baking, but they rarely ever get used for baking because everyone in the house, me included once in a while, <laughs> will snack on them when we feel peckish. I buy the milk chocolate chocolate chips and uh, like seriously, they're good enough to eat on their own. So that's what happens. My husband started it. He is our chocolate, chi chocolate chip thief and it's kind of rubbed off on the rest of us. So that was the story that I wanted to tell in this layout and I thought that a nautical theme would work really well to highlight it because when I was thinking of a title, I found the word ahoy and then the phrase chips ahoy instead of ships ahoy popped into my head and I decided I needed to run with it. So that's where the like theme and the story for my layout all comes from. I added stitching, as you can see, on the wheel and also on the word ahoy. The word ahoy cut in a couple of different um, layers. And so I cut them from different colored pattern papers, but I cut the white one and decided to add some blue stitching to it. And I think it looks so good. Um, I'm going to have to remember to do that again in the future. I've wanted to add stitching to my layout, uh, to the title of the layout, either to stitch it directly to the layout or um, this way. And I at least got one of those done from my scrappy to-do list, bucket list. Right now, I'm just working on my journaling using my favorite hack for creating journaling strips. I'll get those cut out and then arranged on the layout above the title. Oh, for the title where I added the word chips, I actually stamped the word chips out in candy apple ink that is from close to my heart. And then I cut them down into little tiles, squares, so that they would be homemade tiles rather than using sticker alpha tiles. I didn't have any that were in a red font. And so if you're like me and don't have anything like that in your stash, cheat and do it yourself, especially if you have stamp alphas in your stash. It works beautifully. I'm just adding some seaweed to the layout um, just to help tie the whole nautical theme together. I did staple some of the elements to the layout, the little boat that's at the top right of my photo, and then I stapled the um, anchor to the O as well in Ahoy. You may have saw me pulling it up off of the foam squares because I decided to do that after the fact. And uh, I think it just added to the whole um, theme as well. 
And here I'm just adding the date, but I wanted to make sure there was no dark ink left on it before I stamped the date because I was using a light ink color. And that brings me to the end of this layout. There are a few close-ups. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed this layout and this video, and I will be back again as soon as I can to share more creative inspiration with you. Enjoy the rest of your week, friends. Bye.